I'm here actually with my favorite artist of all time, time and you're going to see why because she does absolutely gorgeous, amazing art here and it's, she's selling it at the Cornhill Art Festival in Rochester, New York. So I'm just going to pan some of her art that's so incredible. Everybody, hello, welcome. I'm at the Cornhill Arts Festival and I'm showing Peggy Martin's art. Mm -hmm. Very good. Amazing. She's an amazing, amazing artist. You can see why I think so. Is her name. There we go. The art of Peggy Martin is unbelievable. I'm just going to pan around and show you some more art here. What do you guys think? Any artists in the group? Peeps, welcome. Welcome to the Cornhill Arts Festival in Rochester, New York. Really hot here, so if you're going through a cold snap on the other side of the rock, enjoy. It's nice and warm here. Beautiful historic buildings. All right, buddy. Hey, in it. Listen. Here we go. The beautiful art. Be sure to um, follow me if you want to see more events. Running. I talk about paleo. I talk about good eating. Okay, here we go. And then we're going to get to meet the artist soon, but I just want to show you some of these. She actually has workshops where hopefully she can teach you <laughs> her techniques for doing this. Look at these, absolutely gorgeous. Okay, and I'm going to let you meet Peggy Martin as herself, the artist, and she can tell you about her workshops. Thank you for the hearts, by the way. Look at this, beautiful art. No, this woman is a, a wonderful artist. Please feel free to share this. This is, she's like the real deal. She knows how to paint and do watercolors. And she actually gives workshops of watercolors too. So here you go. I'm going to have you meet her. This is Kathy Martinez. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Kathy. Hi, so you actually have workshops. Yes, I have a wonderful workshop. I, this is my first promo for the workshop. It's going to be November 2nd through 6th at a brand new bed and breakfast in Geneseo. Wow. And what we're going to be doing is a watercolor, five day watercolor workshop. And I talk about color, intensity, not only technique, but how to really use uh, watercolors and maximize your pigments. And I can show you how to save money and time. Uh, but one of the techniques that I'm really excited that I'm going to be teaching there is. Uh, we're going to be doing a watercolor and then we mount it on an ampersand board and this is what it, the finished look oh, looks like. Gorgeous. This is actually 140 pound uh, arches watercolor paper. We do the painting on the paper and then we mount it and then we shave off the corners and this is ready to hand. Oh my goodness. I just sold uh, within the last hour a wonderful piece. Uh, actually the original from that print right there. The iris. Oh, okay. So the iris, right here. Oh my goodness. So yes, this is sold. This is a print of what was sold. And that's the type of watercolor she does. So guys, okay, if you're interested, check the replay. And if you're in this area and you want to take the workshop, please contact me or her. I think Peggy, you have Twitter, right? Yes, I have okay. Twitter. Okay. Peggy underscore Martinez. Okay, thank you. Yes. Beautiful. I'll just show a little bit more of her work and a little bit more of your... We may even try watercolors. some quick art, quick watercolors. These are very loose, very impressionistic uh, watercolors. This is an 8 by 10 What a great idea. So you, I show you how to cut your paper differently and how to sell it. Oh, nice. So these are 8 by 10 a little extra. They fit in the standard frame. These are 5 by 7 And these are very quick and loose. Very quick and loose. And hopefully, do you have any videos that you can show you so, how, how to demonstrate your art? You can I don't have any yet, but if you want to show me how to do it. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you can work something out here. That would be wonderful. Okay, guys, I'm just going to pan around a little bit. Feel free to give me hearts. Feel free to um, follow. And um, if you want to know more, please feel free to contact me. And I'll get you some information. I'll hook you up with some information. I'm going to periscope down now. This is so gorgeous. And... Um, I'm just going to turn this around so you can see me. Art is so fabulous. Um, so anyway, feel free to contact me. And um, I am going to Periscope Down, and I will see you at the finish line. Okay? Bye, guys.